the Kesh Temple Hymn, circa 2600 BC. The princely one, the princely one came forth from the house. Enlil, the princely one, came forth from the house. The princely one came forth royally from the house. Enlil lifted his glance over all the lands, and the lands raised themselves to Enlil. The four corners of heaven became green for Enlil like a garden. Kek was positioned there for him with head uplifted, and as Kek lifted its head among all the lands, Enlil spoke the praises of Kek. Nisaba was its decision-maker. With its words, she wove it intricately like a net. Written on tablets, it was held in her hands. House, platform of the land. Important fierce bull, house keck, platform of the land. Important fierce bull, growing as high as the hills, embracing the heavens. Growing as high as Ykur, lifting its head among the mountains. Rooted in the Abzu, verdant like the mountains, will anyone else bring forth something as great as Kek? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero, Aggie? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its lady, Nine-Tood? The first house. Good house, built in a good location. House Kek, good house, built in a good location. Floating in the heavens like a princely barge like a holy barge furnished with a gate, like the boat of heaven, the platform of all the lands. From the river bank, like a boat cabin, house roaring like an ox, bellowing loudly like a breed bull, house in whose interior is the power of the land, and behind which is the life of Sumer, house, great enclosure, reaching to the heavens, great true house, reaching to the heavens, house, Great crown reaching to the heavens. House, rainbow reaching to the heavens. House, whose platform extends into the midst of the heavens, whose foundations are fixed in the Abzu, whose shade covers all lands. House founded by and praised by Enlil, given an oracle by Mother Nintu. House Kek, green in its fruit. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Kek? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Aggie? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its lady Ninetude? The second house. House ten car at its upper end? Five car at its lower end? House ten burr at its upper end? Five burr at its lower end? House at its upper end, a bison. At its lower end, a stag. House at its upper end, a wild sheep. At its lower end, a deer. House, at its upper end, a dappled wild sheep, at its lower end, a beautiful deer. House, at its upper end, green like a viper, at its lower end, floating on the water like a pelican. House, at its upper end, rising like the sun, at its lower end, spreading like the moonlight. House, at its upper end, a warrior mace, at its lower end, a battle axe. House, at its upper end, a mountain, at its lower end, a spring. House, at its upper end, threefold indeed. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Kek? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Aggie? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its Lady Ninetude? The third house. House, inspiring great awe, called with a mighty name by an house whose fate is grandly determined by the great mountain Enlil, house of the Anuna gods possessing great power which gives wisdom to the people, house reposeful dwelling of the great gods, house which was planned together with the plans of heaven and earth, with the pure divine powers, house which underpins the land and supports the shrines, house mountain of abundance which passes the days in glory, house of nine hersarja which establishes the life of the land, house great hillside worthy of the purification rites altering all things, House without whom no decisions are made. House, good carrying in its hands the broad land. House which gives birth to countless peoples. Seed which has sprouts. House which gives birth to kings, which determines the destinies of the land. House whose royal personages are to be revered. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Kek? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero, Aggie? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its lady Ninetude? The house. It is indeed a city.
Who knows its interior? The house Keck is indeed a city. Who knows its interior? The heroes make their way straight into its interior and perform its oracle rites perfectly. Frisking cattle are gathered at the house in herds. The house consumes many cattle. The house consumes many sheep. Those who sit on daisies bow their necks before it. It wears a crown to vie with the boxwood tree. It spreads out to vie with the poplar. It is growing as green as the hills. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Keck? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Aggie? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its Lady Nine Toon? The Fourth House. House given birth by a lion whose interior the hero has embellished. House Keck given birth by a lion whose interior the hero has embellished. The heroes make their way straight into its interior. In her Serja sits within like a great dragon. Nine Toon. The Great Mother assists at births there. Culpid the ruler acts as lord. Agi, the hero, consumes the contents of the vessels. Urumak, the great herald of the plains, dwells there too. Stags are gathered at the house in herds. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Keck? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Agi? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its Lady Nine Tood? The Fifth House. House positioned over its foundations like a storm, like white bulls standing about on the plain. House founded by the prince in praise on the TG instrument. House in whose interior is the power of the land, and behind which is the life of Zoomer. At whose gate is a lion reclining on its paws. At whose gate is the ruler who decides cases. House at whose door is the great mountain without adversary at whose bolt is a great frisking wild bull, at whose bolt is a beast, a man, at whose is an awe-inspiring lion, whose well-founded storehouse is a corner of heaven, a corner of earth, whose storehouse established as a household, whose terrace is supported by Lahama deities, whose princely great wall, the shrine of Urim. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Keck? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Ajay? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its lady Nintud? The sixth house. House imbued with radiance excellence. House. Lord Nudimud in heaven and earth brickwork of the land. Brickwork grandly in the Abzu. Terrace. Relaxing abode. Holy splendor of the people. House which is seemly for the foreign lands. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Keck? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Agai? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its Lady Nine Tood? The Eighth House. The Holy House, whose is the shrine. The Holy House Kek, whose is the shrine. The house whose lords are the Anuna gods, whose Nuek priests are the sacrificers of Iana. In the house the king places stone bowls in position. The good in priest holds the lead, rope dangling. The A2 priests holds the staff that brings the waters. It takes his seat in the holy place. The Enkum priests bow down. The Pesk priests beat the drumskins. They recite powerfully, powerfully. The bull's horn is made to growl. The drumsticks are made to thud. The singer cries out to the Alla drum. The grand sweet Tiji is played for him. The house is built. Its nobility is good. The house keck is built. Its nobility is good. Its lady has taken a seat in its Ninhursaja. Its lady has taken her seat in it. Will anyone else bring forth something as great as Keck? Will any other mother ever give birth to someone as great as its hero Aggie? Who has ever seen anyone as great as its lady Nintude? The seventh house. Draw near man to the city to the city, but do not draw near. Draw near, man, to the house keck, to the city, but do not draw near. Draw near, man, to its hero Aggie, but do not draw near. Draw near, man, to its lady Nintude, but do not draw near. Praise be to well-built keck, O oh Aggie. Praise be to cherished keck and Ninetude, the eighth house. <laughs>